Despite saying outages could last up to 90 minutes, some Evergy customers found themselves without power for hours. Our reporter Sarah Plague talked with them today. Sarah, not what they wanted to hear. No, and, and there are still many people right now who are waiting for that power to be turned back on, and they've been waiting, as you said, for hours, far past the 60 to 90 minute mark that they had been quoted. And uh, earlier this morning, you can imagine uh, that that number was much higher. But at 10:15 this morning, Evergy said that they would start restoring the power, but many homes went without the heat for hours, five, six, seven hours. One family said their power turned off around uh, seven this morning and didn't turn back on until almost three o'clock clock. Evergy held a news conference at four and they said because of extreme stress on the Southwest Power Pool energy grid, they had to keep conserving energy, which is what took them so long to turn the power back on. People are now concerned about what their bill will look like next month, considering the amount of energy it's going to take to get their homes fully heated again. The challenge is, is that it hasn't been warm before these outages for us, you know, so we're we've got our, our ovens on, we are boiling water, we're doing all those kinds of things. And then to be hit with an outage in the urban core or, or anywhere where it's, it's so insecure to stay there in the first place. I just feel like it should have been better planned that this could have been a situation that could have happened. Yeah. And now you've left thousands of families without power on purpose. Like you literally shut their power off on purpose and now are unable to get it back on. <laughs> it seems ridiculous in the coldest day of the year. And as we heard before, there could be more controlled blackouts. And so you want to stay aware of that. Uh, the people that we talked to said that hopefully next time they'll have better, uh, they'll be better prepared so that they can make the proper arrangements to stay safe and stay warm. I'm Sarah Plake, 41 Action News.